All right, I can't believe I finally died. Ah, I suppose it was always gonna happen sooner or later, people. Still, I almost made it to 20, maybe just about made it through 20 parts without dying. So, I, I, I can, I can, I can rest happy with myself, you know? Uh, really do wish I upgraded my clip capacity a bit more. Shit. Fuck. I can cover myself. Shotgunners. Fuck me. Fuck. Me. Oh my God, these guys can take a pony. Got some of this. Ah, oh, there's just so much space for them to flank you. That's the problem. I think I gotta retreat just a little bit. Gotta patch myself up. Okay. Just gotta scan the area a little bit. That was unfortunate for that poor guy. Ah, well, actually, you know what? Fuck him. They ruined my streak. <laughs> they ruined my no-death streak. That's unforgivable. In the eyes of God and man. Well, maybe not even in the eyes of God and man. Just in the eyes of me. <laughs> Just in the eyes of one bitter gamer. <laughs> oh, well. I heard a guy say holy shit, and the music indicated that he spotted me. I got no idea where he spotted me from though. I'm gonna head up these steps. See if I'm able to find anything. Hey buddy. Is anyone up here with him? We're good. There we go. Get me some rifle rounds. Oh, is that it? Right, come on down. I do. About something uh, a little more your size. It's for emergencies only. Okay. Now, the safety zone, uh, do, do you know how to switch it off? I do. Okay, you just, you gotta respect it. This is not good. Oh, be careful. Okay. <laughs> that was a very, very fatherly moment that Joel just had there. It's, uh, it's good to see their actual relationship developing now, as in, like, properly, they're getting closer now. Uh, because that's, that's pretty much what I've been wanting to see for a while. And all it took was for me to die for it to happen. And my voice just broke. It's been doing that a lot lately. And considering I part of my job is I, I do tech support for Google. And uh, uh, considering I'm on the phone to them, uh, to people quite often, it's... Yeah. <laughs> it's not nice when your voice breaks when you're on the phone to people. It's quite embarrassing. <laughs> like I'm finally becoming a man. Sorry, what was your issue again? Alright, let's take a look-see here. I've got to fix up a new health pack. I think I'll make another one of these bombs. Because, um... I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty damn useful against the uh, against the bloater a video or two ago. So, definitely want to keep a couple of these around. Considering it's 20 years down the line, that birthday card held up remarkably well. It is in, it is in impressive good shape. Definitely from Moonpig. Can guarantee that much. Okay, back up we go. Guess we just hop on down. Ow. <laughs> well, that's instant regret. Alright, I'm just going to take a little patrol around the area. Anyways, there is a very good chance that this is going to be the beginning of a new video, so I just want to welcome you all on back to...
The Last of Us, if that is the case. And if it isn't the case, then, well, this is just in Oh, whoa, wow, hey, whoa. This is a lovely room of death. Let me pick this up. Fireflies note. Oh, they're fireflies. All right. We don't need the fireflies. Sure, they might have started the fight, but we're the ones that have done all the work. It's our blood. Oops. Ah, it, it's, it's gone. It's gone. <laughs> I got rid of it by accident, but we got the gist of it. Essentially, what it looks like is the fireflies were the guys who started the riots against the military in this city. Only it kind of backfired a bit because the guys that they have to attack the military pretty much turned on the fireflies soon afterwards. They're like, yeah, we did pretty good. We don't need you guys. All right, we go that way in a moment. <clears throat> Just want to check this out. Let's see there. Meridian Bank. This is the first building that I've seen in the game that I'm happy to see be destroyed. <laughs> I hate banks. What horrible institutions. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, I think we're all good. Nope, police officer care. Alright, I think we're pretty much ready to carry on with the next with the next bit then. Let's mosey onwards. Ooh. Oh, I thought it was like something fancy. I thought it was like a radio or something like that, but no. I dared to hope and I had my hopes crushed. And now I am sad. Like all of the <laughs> like all of the hunters I've killed. Yeah, I just heave that on open. Don't mind me, Ellie. Don't give it a shot yourself. Don't show initiative. <coughs> hey, do your thing, Ellie. On it. Uh, stupid chain is stuck. Uh, Hold on. I am. There. It's good thinking. To give the girl credit where it's due, that was some pretty good thinking. Considering it was on the spot thinking, I'd have just left him to it. I'm like, alright, that's it. Help me open this. Here. We got it. Hey, she could have. She could have easily have just held that up for him. She is stronger than she looks. I'm guessing we need to go up this way. Do we need to line it up sideways? Uh, we need to go a specific way or there we go uh hop and over oh weapons bunch all right now i got a question for you all i fully intend on doing uh what do you call it uh grand theft auto <clears throat> i fully intend on doing that when it comes out i think it's um i think it's next month actually i think it's coming up pretty soon uh, but what I want to know is Splinter Cell uh, Blacklist is coming out a little later in this month. I'm going to buy it one way or the other, mainly because it's got the two player in it and myself and Jess love doing... Um, we love doing co-op games anyway, but we especially love Splinter Cell after playing, uh, I think it was Conviction. So I'm curious, if you'd like to see a series for Splinter Cell Blacklist, just let me know. Oh shit, get down, get down. Busy couple of days, huh? Yeah, whatever, man. Damn, no food, no pair of shoes. We got nothing. Let's go. Yeah, that wasn't very chivalrous. He shot her in the okay. shot her in the back with a shotgun. You know, that's that's pretty rough. That's not a good way to go. It's not exactly how anyone envisions themselves going. You know, no one thinks to themselves, "If I had to go right now, I would love it to be a shotgun blast to the back." Mainly because there's no guarantee that it would kill you. Yes, it killed her. So I guess most historical evidence says that yeah, a shotgun shot to the back would kill you. But um, well, but yeah. They 
Alright, uh, if they're willing to live and let live. <laughs> Ellie, you psychopath! Whoa! 